Objection! Hello everybody and welcome to Video Games Awesome Live. This is Ace Attorney Justice for All episode 4, 5-ish? Four, 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 four. Uh, Are you ready for some magic? Are you ready yeah. for some magical courtroom drama? It's notoriously the worst case. <clears throat> so I'm told I remember it being bad, but I just don't remember it being as bad as they say it is. Of all the games, too? Of all the games, of, of the entire the series, things. this is the most fucked up of all the logic. <laughs> the Why? entire Justice for All in the entire series is known for its being the worst, and this one probably weights it down the most, but the preceding case oh, probably really? contributes. Okay, I didn't know that either. That Justice for All was the worst. I'm not looking forward to it, but let's just get, let it go had... to start. <laughs> just, just to start with, if we go into it letting it go. Yeah. Yeah. Just I'm go with it. Still gonna. <laughs> Flow, man. Mm. I'm gonna solve chill. this case. Yeah, you're gonna. <laughs> Here we go. So we watched Ladies this last gentlemen. episode, but prepare to witness oh, right. a man who has mastered the wonder of flight. <laughs> the world's greatest magician, the one, the only. Maximilian Galactica! He's so pretty. I know. Total trap. Uh, <laughs> he's, um, so we know from last episodes, what, should I say what we know is about to happen or should I leave it clean? Just let it happen? People already watched it. Ah, whatever. I'll leave it clean. Okay. We'll act surprised still what happens. <gasps> he disappeared! We previewed this on the last episode. Okay. Very big circus, circus entrance. Hmm. Very big. I don't know how you can talk for the entire episode. I don't know either. I have to practice this. Oh, the left hand has two ah. fingers, or one finger, and then the other one has. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Right then, it's perfect. Maybe, maybe cup a little uh, bit more. Like, wait. kind of cup your hands like this a little bit more. Uh, you know, like bend your fingers a little bit more. Nice beard, pearls. Yeah, that's got it. Oh, <laughs> That's yeah. pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that was like living a dream. I haven't even caught my breath yet. Hmm. Hee <laughs> hee, that was amazing, wasn't it, barely? It was great. There was a dancing bear, and a tiger that jumped through the ring of fire, and an elephant who rode a giant ball. Not to mention the guy who <laughs> flew through the air. Yeah, Max Galactica, he was absolutely fabulous. Huh? What? Max? Max Galactica, the world's greatest magician. M a magic Ikian? <laughs> No, a magician! Fresh are so kawaii. <laughs> kawaii desu, sugoi! <laughs> um, Mr. Nick? Huh? What is it, Pearls? Does magic have anything to do with channeling spirits? I don't think it has anything to do with channeling. You don't know about magic, do you, Pearls? I'm sorry. <laughs> Fuck. Needs more desu. <laughs> desu. What is coming up on the screen here? Oh, it's a mouse. Derf a derf. A mouse in a mug? Come on, baby Hank, get in there. Yeah, get in there. Defend my honor. It's just hard. I have a lot of stuff back here today. Maybe I should get, I'll get rid of the iPad later. Okay, here we go. I braved the winter cold and took Pearls to see the circus. It's been six months since the incident in Curane Village. It was during that terrible time that I met Pearls. It seems like she's starting to get back to normal. Ah, it's time to go. You're right, we can't miss the last train. Pearls, you remember the train? Of course I did. But I don't really understand what everyone means by express train. Well, Nick, see you later. I'll be by to clean the office. It's got to be spotless for the new year. 
Don't worry about it, really. You are going to visit Mr. Nick on New Year's? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I am glad you will get to spend your New Year's with your special someone. Prepare! Look, it's time to go! Ow. <laughs> Happy New Year, Mr. Nick. Happy New Year. I really hope it'll turn out that way. See, assholes? Now you can't picture pearls with any other voice. <laughs> no. Nope. No. Nope. I love it. Well, today I, uh, today wraps it up for this year. I hope we can finish cleaning this place up in one day. <laughs> Hello? This is Wright & Co. Nick is t -t terrible Ah, Maya, perfect timing. Things are terrible here, too! <laughs> ha! The office is a terrible mess, and I have to clean it up! What are you talking about? Um, my dirty office. What are you talking about? Listen, Nick, you have to turn on the TV! Um, the TV? Now let's check in at the scene! Huh? What happened? <laughs> Why would he say that? Why would he say that when he turned on the TV and that says and it says that? Imagine every time you turn on CBC News <laughs> yeah. and it says, "Now what? let's uh, join uh, <coughs> our, our correspondent at the scene." Huh? What happened? <laughs> Imagine that. <laughs> Thank you. We're here at Barry Big Circus. The Barry Big Circus has come the center of the sensational murder. Oh! A scene was created. The scene has created quite a stir among the throngs of excited onlookers. The very, I mean. The very, I mean, very big circus? That's the circus we went? That's the circus we went to, right? They're saying that there was a murder. Yeah, they arrested him too. They arrested who? Max. They arrested Max Galactica. Maximilian Galactica. Fans call him Max, a popular magician who can fly through the sky at will. Maya said she was a huge fan of Max. All right, Nick, see you in two hours at the detention center. Huh? What? See you there. S you've got still plenty of time to clean at your office later. B what? <coughs> I just love his reaction to that. Beep. Uh, what? let's examine the office. Why I don't not? see it being that dirty. No, man. A poster of the newest member of the Steel Samurai universe? Maya went out and bought it right away. She's a sucker for all things Steel Samurai. I hear they're giving away the new guy, the new guy's own movie. Ooh. I just know Maya's going to drag me out to see it with her. Who's the new guy? Was that explained to any, uh, like, did that get told to uh, us? I don't, yeah, I don't oh. know if that would be the new guy or if there's a new new guy. Huh. All right. I don't think it was explained. Let's talk to Chuck. Hasn't been explained. Okay. Charlie? Wait, it's Chuck. Is, oh, does he call him Charlie and Chuck? Those are in here. Yeah, maybe. A quiet, decorative... Oh, a quite decorative plant. I wouldn't mind his help cleaning this place up. <laughs> and... There's a giant building just outside the window. It's the Gatewater Hotel. Mm -hmm. A high-class luxury hotel. Until recently, it had been a normal business class hotel. All right, let's get... Oh, they changed themselves to yeah. a luxury hotel mm. because of the tourism for that case. Yes. Let's head down to the detention center, see what's up with Max Galactica. It is December 28th. Wow. Pretty close to our times. Pretty close. Yeah. What are they talking about? Why did they arrest Max? You're asking the wrong man on that one, Maya. Maybe he used magical skills to deal death with a sleight of hand. Maximilian Galactica would never do such a thing! Fabulous! <laughs> what? <laughs> the young lady just said it was absolutely fabulous! What a clever girl! She's a fabulous understanding of events! What's all this about fabulous talk? Welcome to the visitor's room! 
It's Maximus! Look, it's the real Maximilian Galactica! It's perfect, spot on! <laughs> All right, sweetie, pick a card, any card. <laughs> he called me sweetie soon! <laughs> Nick! <laughs> Time's running out, sweetie! Pick a card and a card! How can she pick a card through the glass? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at her face. Uh, th this one. Ah, <laughs> uh, I thought you would pick that one, sweetie. The Ace of Hearts! Ah, he got it, he got it, Nick! Look, he got it! What can I say, sweetie? I only have the Ace of Hearts in this deck. <laughs> You've stolen one of my most valuable possessions. One of Maximilian Galactica's hearts! Max, soon! Well, time to make this absolutely fabulous time! Max, you should let Nick pick a card! Ick! I don't want to steal one of his hearts! <laughs> <laughs> I knew Phoenix. Uh, he's flustered around all women and he's also flustered around all feminine men. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, and you are? Oh, how silly of me. You must be Sweetie's driver. Her driver? Whatever. Hurry up and pick a card and a card. <laughs> you guys don't. Some people like the cut voice. See, I thought it would be too typical to go, like, give a gay lisp, first yeah. of all. Yeah. I consider Dame Edna. <laughs> Especially oh. after, after having just watched, um, uh, The Hobbit. Dame, Dame Edna's in The Hobbit? Dame Edna does the voice of the Troll King. Really? And when I'm watching it, I'm like, I recognize this face, and I recognize this voice. Crazy but it wasn't Dame face? Edna's voice, but it was the intonations. The face has like the same eyes kind huh. of like it's weird really and uh goblin king i was pretty impressed hmm i see this movie but there was something about him as soon as you see him you're just like what is it what is he mm -hmm. he's somebody mm -hmm. anyways <laughs> but yeah they gave the likeness of the actor a little bit to the character all right um i want this one so, sweetie, let's be honest here. You came to this visitor's room to visit me, didn't you? Yes, I'm your biggest fan! Fabulous! Absolutely fabulous! Thank you so much! Hey, um, what about my card? <laughs> Think of it as a souvenir. Well, Nick, I think it's time to get to work. What's the matter, Nick? Why are you looking at the ceiling? I was just thinking about what I should have for lunch. <laughs> <laughs> Sweetie, drop Porcupine Head over there. Shower me with your attention, okay? Uh, yes! <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely fabulous! Absolutely cringe-inducing. All right. Do we yeah, trust that is this guy that is gonna innocent? Hurt you after a while? I'll be fine. Mm. Yeah, what the shit? He's pretty cavalier about being charged with murder and. You think it's a front? You think he's actually a tortured soul who puts up like a completely different personality? I don't know. He looks pretty. F he's I don't fine. think he's. I don't think he's evil. I think he's probably innocent. Once yeah, again, based yeah. on Phoenix Wright logic. It's likely that he's innocent. Let's just hope he's not difficult. Yeah. Let's see what happened. What's up, dude? Max, I was hoping you could tell me a little bit about yourself. Fabulous. I think we should get to know one another better, too. Why don't you come sit next to me? I don't think that's allowed. <laughs> um, there's a big piece of glass it's between us. Oh, uh, sweet Jesus! What in the world? <laughs> If only I could use magic, then I could make this world disappear. What is this guy talking about? <laughs> Anyways, lately you've become awfully famous, haven't you, Max? 
<laughs> That's Maximilian to you, Pokemon head. Get it straight? Jeez, people nowadays. They get their panties all in a bunch over nothing. Uh, anyways, Maximilian, you won a very prestigious award recently, didn't you? I did it need! It was fabulous! I hate this guy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm gonna keep that voice going, because you should hate him too. I won the Magician's Grand Prix, held by the Association of International Magicians. I believe it's pronounced pricks. <laughs> pricks. It's an award that recognizes that I am the most fabuloso of fabulous mood magicians. There was a trophy and a bust. It was a fab. I mean, it was an amazing day. Wow, that's incredible. Isn't it? I'm certifiably the greatest magician in the world. <laughs> I'm going to guess he didn't win a trophy for most modest magician. You are assigned to an exclusive contract in the Berry Big Circus, correct? That's the long and short of it. <coughs> you show your research. Hmm. You shall do your research, sweetie. I'm in first. <laughs> you just can't. You just can't watch a magician on TV, you know. Magic is so fabulous. You have to see it with your own eyes, sweetie. You're right. You're so right. However, the circus is a dinosaur, a thing of the past. Nowadays, no one ever cares about what goes on there. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I think my balls just dropped. <laughs> huh? What do you mean? That's why I signed the contract. That's why you signed the contract? Thanks to me, the Bourbon Circus is fabulously power popular. People come out in droves to watch a glimpse of the magic of Max Galactica. I revived the dinosaur that is the circus. Wow, this voice likes to like get, just become completely different halfway through. Congratulations, <laughs> Fraser. Huh. Thanks, guys. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I knew my balls would drop, but this is ridiculous. This is, that's insinuating that they like dropped really far. Like down to your knee? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But to me, it was just another magic trick. Isn't it wonderful, sweetie? Yes! I made all the old crusty circus performances obsolete! But I kind of like the circus performances! Maya looks a bit down. Should never meet your hero, folks. Yeah, dude. Mm. Tell me what happened at the very big circus. Ah, last night the ringmaster was murdered! The ringmaster? You mean Russell Perry? Someone smashed him over the head! I hear he was slumped over on the ground. Even though it was the middle of the night, the police princess was fabulous. The police questioned me at length. Questioned you what? About everything. It was last... I was the last to see the Rickmaster before he was murdered. I saw him last night in his room. Mm. So then, why were you arrested? Arrested? Why don't... Don't make an anthill into a mountain, sweetie. They just wanted to consult me on matters, that's all. Mm. Nick! I don't think Max understands how serious it is. She's right. I think we should. Sh I should shock him back into reality. Before the murder, you met with the ringmaster. Uh huh. What did you talk about? Uh, things that aren't important for your ears. Maya, would you please ask him? What did you talk about with the ringmaster, Max? It was nothing small talk, really. We were just having a chat about my salary. Salary? I am the one bringing all of the crowds to the circus. I think I should be compensated as such. Don't you agree? <clears throat> yeah. Yes. 
No, that's all you talked about? Of course, it was a small. It was a fabulous chat. Oh! oh. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. Man, already. Ooh. Fabulous. Why does he have to keep saying fabulous? <laughs> okay, we'll take a break here. When we come back, we're gonna bust down these Cyclops off of Maximilian Galactica.